Now, the one thing I like doing when we're out and about, we, we go in a camper and uh, go to visit places. I always took Lego figures with me to take pictures of um, in the locations. I've got the larger torches. I'll put some pictures on the screen now. Um, but also um, the clocks and we've got, I've got a lot of these ones which are the keyring type. Um, now you don't really want that in the um, thing so what I'm going to do is show you how to just take that off and then you can just use them as larger mini minifigures. So let's get rid of those ones because those are the ones that so far I've got loads more than that but I just haven't took off. What you do is just get a pair of pliers if you see the, uh, let's just push those back a little bit more, um, you see the not there all you need to do is just put the pliers around there and just hold the head um, and then just pull that back from side to side up down left right and then eventually it can take some time like it is on this one and then they pop out now sometimes what happens is like what's happened on this one that does break off there but you know it's, it's below the head so yeah it's absolutely fine for just using um, in those, um, but they can, oh, we've got one here, they can come out fully like that, which is then the actual pin, try and get that there into focus a little bit, uh, that holds it in and that, so yeah, um, that's just one way of doing it. I mean, as you can see, some do come straight out clean, so you've got no part of the metal left. I mean, due to a medical problem, um, I do actually have um, problems with grip in my hands, so it was a little bit hard for me to get them out. You um, may have a, a better experience at doing this. I mean, if the actual uh, bit gets stuck in, then you can, you know, like with the headgear on this, you can then take players and then pull that out as well. The one main advantage of taking the actual keyring out is if the Lego minifig has got a headgear like a helmet or you know hair or anything else that can then be swapped onto another one. Um, also remember these ones you can change the arms as well as the hands on these ones. This also works with ones that have the head attached to like a, a body part like with Chewbacca here. Um, this then can, you take the pin out and then the head with the actual like costume or whatever um, can come off and then that can go on to other minifigs so you can change like the colour of the trousers and etc like that. Well, thank you for watching this video. Um, hope you've enjoyed it. Um, I mean, if you want to have a look at my channel, you'll see that I do go out and I take these pictures. And if you like, uh, give this a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel and everything else. So thank you and goodbye.